Hello, my dear friends. Today it's evening time, second day of October 2030. I'm here in Kiev, capital of Ukraine. That's the time of Apimondia, World Beekeeping Congress here in Kiev, Ukraine. And I'm pleased to tell you that I'm standing here in this hall, this innovational hall, where different people from Ukraine and other countries have been gathered during several days and showing the new innovational technologies, new interesting ideas which we want to realize in life. They're from Ukraine, from Russia, Kazakhstan and other countries, from Israel. We heard here interesting reports about different beekeeping technologies and of course about beehives, about bees, about their rearing, very unusual new innovational technologies. Yes, in Apimondia many delegates have published papers in this huge book Proceedings of Apimondia Congress. And here there's a very thick book, pretty heavy. Many papers published here, I guess probably over 1,000 papers. And other people, they deposited here very interesting posters on walls of Abimondia Congress. And I've seen here, they're very interesting. But we're in Ukraine, don't forget about it. And what's famous in Ukraine? Yes, the first, first beehive which have been invented here in Ukraine. And I am pleased to show you these three books of Petro Prokopovich, famous Ukrainian beekeeper. I am honorable to say that these three books have been published in the second time like proceedings all together because group of editors, enthusiastic editors, enthusiastic Ukrainian beekeepers gathered together and united their efforts to publish this book, to collect many, many papers of Petro Prokopovich and describe his beehive, translate his publications from Russian to Ukrainian, check all these publications, check mistakes, add new notes about his biography. And these three volumes, they're very, very valuable for maybe for beginner beekeepers, not only, but also for all beekeepers who is interested in history, if we can keep this information for him and for children. And about beehive, those beehive you can see in the museum of beekeeping in Kiev, in the Institute of Beekeeping. But even here we have a beehive. You see, that's multiple story beehive of Vasil Priyatolenko. Yes, every multiple story beehive looks a little bit like a Prokopovich beehive, but of course it is different. Because this one has a, a lot of interesting, unusual innovations. And you will see it in other videos. But I want to again to say a lot of thanks for this group of people, editors here. Gornich, Solomka, Korsh, and other people who are editors of these publications, these three volumes of Petro Prokopovich papers. I hope you can find it in a book or ask editors and we'll give you just copies of these books. So that's a short introduction of Apimondia. Short introduction only these three books of Ukrainian beekeepers, of course this very old one, but Ukrainian beekeepers that are famous not only in in this one first innovation, first book, but also they are writing now a lot of new, interesting, innovational, useful books. You can ask Ukrainian beekeepers, keep in contact with them, ask about their books, new publications, exchange ideas, visit meetings of beekeepers, and to be in touch with Ukrainian beekeepers, they will be glad to contact with you, share ideas, and to be in cooperation with all beekeepers worldwide in many countries, in Europe, Asia, America, Australia, and New Zealand. And good luck, everybody, and best greetings from Apimondia 2030 in the city of Kiev, Ukraine. Good luck.